Hi, welcome to your Products That Way to Apocalypse series, day 43. So today, I think we're going to go check out the broccoli again. I think we spent like a one full day here. I think we're just doing a tailor egg and cook egg, and I think that we used all of our thread. So we got to go get some more thread. Uh, for cooking, we got the level up. So we, we just need to re read the skill book here. Wonder if we should actually just throw these uh, cooking ingredients back in the uh, freezer. I think we, we did cook some things. <laughs> if we're not going to be cooking for a little bit, might as well just put these back in the freezer so they stay fresh for longer. We just got our cooking ingredients here. We got five uncooked things. <laughs> Maybe we'll just un uh, bring these uncooked... Oh, we have a whole bunch of cooked things already. Never mind. Let's just throw these uncooked things back in the fridge. We have a bunch of uh, cooked things. A bunch of them are actually really good. So if you throw some of these uh, cooked uh, stir fries in the freezer, this is like 1,000 calories. So it's like 763. Maybe try to keep some of our better, better food in the freezer. 800 calories. 738. It's almost as good as a stew, actually. <clears throat> uh, it takes a lot less inventory space, like half the space. We just take these. Like, we have to bring like some food to eat too. So maybe we'll bring uh we'll bring four stir fries because I think we're gonna stay stay for a couple days. So we say here we'll bring four stir fries and if the if the uh broccoli is not ready, then we'll maybe stay there for a day. <laughs> we have a uh, carpentry three we can read. We have cooking five we can read. Maybe we can do some uh, tailor it to get some more tailor materials. We got food, we got water, tailor supplies, we got weapon. One, two, we got a backup weapon. Should, should we get uh, another backup weapon? Eventually, we're gonna have to hit up that uh, weapon place and go get some more weapons. We got metal bars, metal pipes, axe. <coughs> Eventually, we're going to run out of weapons, probably. There's another hammer right here. Yeah, we're, we're probably running right pretty low. We gotta start lo looking for uh, weapons at some point. So yeah, that's where generator should be fine. And then we're driving this vehicle. Oh, it's, I think it's better on fuel, and I think it's a lot quieter. There's a loud truck. And that loud truck probably takes more fuel to drive it to. So let's go here. Couple zombies here, we're gonna have to deal with. There's like three zombies, four, five, six. Something like that. Let's go up here. Oh, there's like another group over here. So, it wouldn't, wouldn't it take too long to clear this place again if we wanted to clear it again for some reason? There are three up there, that's it. I was keep going up here and then just go back to the farm up again. So our main goal at the moment is just to go check the broccoli. This car's easier to fit here too. Like the, the truck is probably bigger. This uh, small car can uh, fit, fit in small spaces a lot easier probably. It's a lot easier to dodge the zombies too. Like this place is probably a uh, prop for the truck but this car just goes right through. We didn't even realize those two cars were there the way. I guess we we'll just go right up here. Here's where I usually park. Let's <coughs> uh, we'll go ch check on the vegetables. So if we harvest these, may maybe we'll be the next farming level. Maybe we just read the farming book. They won't have to keep coming out here. Because the reason we kept coming out here is just because the farm's here. And then uh, now the uh, food's going to go bad. It's kind of like, like the fridges. You got the fridges, all the food's going to go bad in the fridges. Then we got the farm here. All, all the food at the farm is going to go bad. Yeah, it's just the, just these trees here. This fence that's always sketchy. It's like, who, who's by the fence and who's in the trees? <laughs> I guess it was alright. 
No wonder if we get the broccoli, maybe we should just go harvest the tomatoes because I, I don't know how long they're going to take to be seen back. They get on too long. We haven't seen seen any zombies yet. Here's one. Here's, here's our first customer. Ready for harvest broccoli, so it's still not even ready. And uh, we we planned for that because like, if, if we can just find a place here, then we just uh, re read a book. Ready for harvest broccoli. We can find something to do here. Oh, we did we didn't loot these guys by the looks of it. <clears throat> so I guess we can just hang around here and kill zombies for a bit. Maybe uh, read skill books if you want. Then just wait, wait for this uh, broccoli. So I guess we can even stay at home for another day. I guess we just have to hover over it. You know, you have to do that. You just have to hover over it. There's some maggots already. Oh, there's a big group of zombies right up here. I guess they're all, they're all coming for us already. Yeah, we're so good. Our character sucks with, with uh, very underweight, zero strength, zero fit. But uh, now we're so strong. <laughs> That's because we have like the, the level 5 weapon skill. Level 5 we weapon skill does a lot. It's like 15% increased attack speed. 15% increased attack speed. 15% crit chance. I think it's like 50% increased damage. We already have level 4 strength already too. So just cut to an area, just clear all the zombies, so that it gets easier as you level up. It was pretty easy at the beginning of the game. I guess it's a little bit, little bit annoying. It takes like ten hits or something. Oh, we took all of them out. A big, big group was just like nothing, pretty much. Cause we didn't even realize we were just walk, walking right into. It. I guess there's even more into the group up here. Oh, there's a big group up there, too. There's two groups. He's coming from the north. He's coming from the east, west. I think someone else is coming. Oh, there he is. Maybe we'll just keep uh, clearing away here and then work towards the outs over here. There's like an alarm system here recently. And I guess we can loot a bit maggots from the zombies here that have been here for a bit. So a few zombies there, a group there, then a group there. It's like three, three groups. There we go, now we just pull a few more. Oh, so now we got a few, few zombies coming. He's coming too. 
So we got a good number that we got. That was just kind of like one, one by one. So take care of that, then we get the group there, the group there. They will go take care of these guys. See what some of that will come. There's like three, three guys left up here. Then we got this group clear though, there's just that, the other two groups there. Maybe we'll eat some food. So it's here, maybe we'll eat like half of it. We'll, we'll try to ration out our food just so we can maybe stay out here. Just in case we need to wait, wait for the broccoli for, for a day or something, a day or two. There's like three guys down here.
it's just like the, these four left, that's it. Then if there's like two two cover, then he's got two left, that's, that's it. Let me take out this group. We clear, cleared out this area a little bit. There's probably still another big group over there we just see. Oh, but I guess that's good for now. Then we'll go up here, maybe work our way to the tomatoes. Maybe clear out that area a bit. And then maybe stay the night. <clears throat> then we'll check the uh, broccoli and the uh, tomatoes tomorrow, maybe. So what if the uh, broccoli is done yet? Probably not. And we killed all these zombies here already. So that's always the broccoli is here. Ready for harvest broccoli. So it's not quite ready yet. Let's go check the uh, tomatoes. That I, I think the tomatoes were right behind this house. Oh, it's right behind this house up here. So we go here. There, if there's any zombies here, we we'll kill them along the way. I, I guess we'll eat, eat half of this. Oh, just in case find some zombies that'll give us the strength bonus. And we were just losing weight, so I made it so that we're not losing weight anymore. We're not picking up the uh, watches because we don't have the electrical two book. If we would have had the electrical level 2 skill book, we would have probably read it. And then we would have been uh, uh, just about to like all the watches still to get the electrical up. <clears throat> but we, we don't have the skill book. After searching all these houses, not a single one of them had electrical 2. <coughs> so let's come back and collect all the watches later. Big group down here. But let's also start working on this big group down here. There's just two of them coming, that's it. Because of the four, at least all of all of them recovered. All of them recovered now. I think crowbar on his back. Or if we should just take the, take the crowbar for some reason.
Maybe you should uh, take this nightstick and start using it. it I guess it's just because night, nightsticks are so rare, I think. It's so rare to find a nightstick we don't like using them. Is that the whole group? That looks like that was everybody. So we cleared them out. And then we gotta check to see the uh, tomato plants up here. Seed bearing tomatoes. Young tomatoes. So what, what if the tomatoes is ready? Well, let's just get rid of this group here first. So you go pick the uh, tomatoes at least. At, le at least one of them. We can just pick one of the tomatoes, that's it. Or was it just one uh, by himself? There's somebody here. Get the tomatoes. These aren't ready yet. I wonder if we should just go get them, because maybe we have enough tomato seeds that if we just harvest them. But I guess the broccoli is not ready to... Oh, the, the, yeah, we, we can't harvest the tomatoes because they're young. They're, they're, not, uh, they're not even ready to be harvested yet. So let's go down here. Go back to the broccoli, I guess. Go check out that area. See, so harvested one of the tomatoes. One of the tomatoes is ready. So it's still not ready yet. So yes, let's go here. Just keep clearing uh, th this area a bit more. Right, if we should go to the uh, farming store that's down there. Maybe we should clear, clear the house so we can search the scale box. I'm pretty sure we searched that house already for scale box. I'm pretty sure we searched those two houses up there. We didn't search uh, this house probably, and probably this one. I 
Tower Savage Cabin. Or another one. Somewhere right there. So we already hit before he stuck up. Oh, then maybe we'll get these guys. And then maybe if I want one of the three books I'm looking for. they were searching for what? Oh, there's zombies here already. Electrical team, a better working team, and mechanics too. We're searching for those three level, level two skill books. We still don't have them. Big group right there. So let's go check to see if we could uh, go in this house or see if there's an alarm system. Doors locked. So where's the bookshelf? Right there. Alarm system. Check the bookshelf. Oh, we got the card key. Better work in one. Uh, so let's just go here. Let's just hit the card key. Maybe go open the windows if we have time. I don't forget have time. Are they gonna kill us if we open all the windows? It doesn't really matter if you open the windows, Tyro. I guess there's an alarm system there. Maybe we'll check this house next. We'll just wait for the alarm system to drop out. Maybe we'll hang out over in this area or something. <coughs> we just got like one, one zombie. I believe we searched like every house in this area here. Yeah, behind us. This is pretty much it, so let, let's just uh, throw us on the ground and we'll see if there's anyone else. And then maybe we'll check the house oh, just to the north here, because we never got in that one. Nobody else here. We never got in this one and uh, the one after that one. We've been in this one. I think this is, is this the alarm system house? Which one are we going? We went in this one already. We didn't go in the second one then. Let's 
Yeah, nobody's over here. They all went to the alarm system. Somebody's inside the bathroom. Find the book we're looking for. Yeah, it's just this one bookshelf. Yeah, it's, it was just, just like a sheet, sheet of paper. Got this one. I don't think we got this one. We didn't see what was about it. Did we see this one already? No, we didn't. Let's go here. Maybe we'll find one of those level 2 skill books here. Or maybe an alarm system. Oh, somebody has decided, so there shouldn't be an alarm system then. He's got this car key here. Oh, he's just here, right there at the door. Oh, we found Mechanics 2. We actually found a Mechanics 2 skill book. Mechanics level 2, so we found it so we could level up uh, Mechanics here now. Let's finish that one. We, we can read that one. Maybe a TV? <clears throat> Maybe a v VHS tape, I guess. There's level, so we got one of them. We just need to get the other, the other two level two skill books. So we found it. Me mechanics level two. We can level up mechanics, and then eventually we could get into those locked vehicles. I, I think is what you unlock. There's zombie right here. There's probably a whole bunch of them because the alarm system. So got a good number of them there. We do have to find a place to sleep though at some point. Oh, 
Sorry, hi there. There's a big group there too. There's just two big groups to pull from, but. I think we should probably try to find a place to sleep pretty soon. I guess we, we do have a lot of skill books to read. And we did actually finally find a new skill book. I think we should mark on the map that we made of that place. Oh, we already did. So we just have like the, these four places to go at the end then. There's like two zombies right up there. There's a huge group right there. One zombie down here.
Now we're tired, we have to go to sleep already. So we're trying to see if we can find a place to go to sleep. I'm sure there's one up here, there's two of them. There's a big group over there, they're watering over here in this direction. Guess we should, should take care of these two. They're just gonna follow us. And if it's on the fence, we should should just be able to kill one anyways. So the uh, t tired modifier wouldn't really do anything. I just don't know where we're gonna sleep though. Maybe this house is actually okay. I guess may maybe they'd still see you. I guess we gotta go to the these nice houses over here. Might have to use a flashlight. Let me see if I read this one. I don't think this was a good one to sleep in. Because there's a zombie group in there. with curtain. So you sleep here then. So what does he eat all of the, eat half of this I guess? I guess we wait till it's a uh, bedtime. It's like 2230. We're, we're gonna wake up at some point. Maybe we'll start reading this uh, cooking skill book. And then uh, tomorrow <laughs> we'll go check, check on the broccoli again. Then maybe after harvest the broccoli, we'll get the uh, farming level. We're not 100% sure. There's no way to get the uh, broccoli to be ready to be harvested. But until then, we can just sit there and clear the area, level up our other skills, make the area safer and everything. So I don't think any zombies are here, so we can speed up time then probably. Do we stay here till like one in the morning? That way we know that we'll wake up and they'll probably be like after six or something. And we'll have this uh, skill book all the way red, so if we need to uh, cook something later, we can actually go cook something. So we have red the uh, cooking skill book. Let's throw that in here. So let's eat, eat all this. I think it's just half of it left. We still have like uh, two stir fries left. Two full stir fries. Got a whole, whole bunch of water yet. Yeah, then we're tired, so it's, it's the second level of being tired. So that's good. We'll just see if we can uh, go collect the, uh, the, the broccoli tomorrow then. That's gonna be the only thing.